dear students today i am going to teach you one theorem this is the third theorem of parallelogram it's related about area so here the question is like this prove that the area of triangle is half of area of parallelogram standing on same base and between same parallel lines so this is the theorem so here we can draw figure like this one parallelogram this one parallel is like this r a m u is one parallelogram and one triangle is here r a i is a triangle they are standing on same base so this base look at here this r a is the base for this parallelogram and this for this triangle also see r a i on base r a r a m u also on base r a so now this is same base and between same parallel line means this line is parallel to this line these two lines are parallel and then this is parallelogram let us put parallel sign this is parallelogram this r a m u is the parallelogram standing on base r a r a i is the triangle standing on same base r a and between same parallel lines this i m n R A. Now we have to prove this one. So let us write down given here first of all. Given. Given. In given we write like this. Triangle R A I and parallelogram. Parallelogram R A M U are standing standing on same base same base the name of the base is r a same base r a and between between same parallel parallel lines r a and our parallel lines are this one this is r a and i m r a and i m in between these two now to prove we need to prove here to prove we need to prove the area of triangle this r a i is half of area parallelogram r a m u so we can write like this triangle r a i is equals to 1 by 2 parallelogram in short form we can write p a r m dot r a m u in area because their area we have to prove area of triangle r a i equals to half of area of parallelogram r a m u we can write in area is like this now construction needed so construction in construction we will construct like this from this point a let us draw one line parallel to this r i like this this is r i so from this we will write parallel like this look at here always while co while constructing this edge of the e scale should be parallel to this line so that it will be like this see we will draw like this see this is construction now let us name this r a here b let us write so R A V I Ravi will be one of the parallelogram. So we are making this and this parallel we are making. So construction letter from A will add like this from A A V is drawn parallel to R I. So let us write down here from A A A V is drawn parallel to parallel to to what r i parallel to r i we have done now we will prove this one now proof proof now in proof let us draw let us make two columns here where we will write statements and reasons okay let us draw like this 
now one vertical line as well we will draw now here statements regions statement and regions okay we can make one line here over here also so it look nice if you draw lines like this it look, it look nice okay now we'll prove like this figure here see this r a and i m was already parallel and from construction we made this a v and r i also parallel so being this opposite sides are parallel this r a v i is a parallelogram we can write that one now the first statement is number one r a v i is a parallelogram The reason is being opposite sides parallel. Parallel. Now in second one, number two, we can write like this. In this parallelogram R A V I look at here. R A V I this is diagonal so diagonal divide the parallelogram into equal area always in a parallelogram if you draw diagonal like this in a parallelogram if you draw a diagonal then this area and this area will be equal so we can write like this so look at here uh, triangle r a i r a i is equals to half of parallelogram r a v i in area like this we can write now why region region is diagonal of parallelogram divide it in equal area diagonal divided in equal area number three now in number three we have learned previous theorem in previous theorem what we have learned if there are two parallelograms standing on same base and between same parallel like this r a m u is one parallelogram it is standing on r a again r a v i is another parallelogram standing on same base r a then their area will be equal so r a m u will be equal to r a v i so we can write this one here yeah? So parallelogram parallelogram R A M U R A M U is equals to parallelogram R A V I in area. The reason is second theorem which I have uploaded yesterday. So according to that uh, area area of parallelograms on same base and between same parallel lines are equal area parallelogram on same base and between same parallel lines are equal so now number four we can write look at here now in this number three and two you look at here properly see r a i is half of parallelogram r a v i we have got this one yes and now here again r a v i is equal to r a m u we have got this two also equal r a v i ravi equal to ramu and Rai is half of Ravi. Now instead of this Ravi, since Ramu and Ravi are equal, this Ravi can be replaced by Ramu. This one. Instead of R A V I, now R A V I is equal to R A M U. So R A M U we can put here. So we can get like this. See, triangle R A I is equals to half of parallelogram. Instead of R A V I, we will write r a m u now r a m u in area 
the reason is from statement 2 and 3 from this two statement because we are substituting the value of uh, RFEI in number 2 we are getting like this so in this way we can prove the theorem this statement we need to prove it see RAI equals to RAI equals to paragraph RAMU hence hence proved in this way we can prove this theorem thank you for watching this video